So when I think about that age for you and, and, and playing a high school kid, there's a certain empathy or a, or a vibe that Freaks and Geeks got totally right about really understanding the humanity and insecurity yes. of high school. Starting out in an environment like that must have been very freeing in a way because there wasn't, there weren't these perfectly segregated lines of this is, this is the kind of show it is. Or no, the script was different. I'll right. tell you that. It was so beautifully written and it was so heartfelt. And if you know Paul Feig, it's just like, it just has his heart all over it, yeah. you know? And then with Jed coming in and, and, and the people they chose and just bringing that to life was, I mean, it was even, it was even lifted beyond the page. So, but I fell so in love with that. And it seemed so human compared to everything else. I was supposed to go in and test for something else before that, but I knew that if I got the other job, that there would be no way that I could do this job, so I had to pass up. I got a phone call from an exec who said, you know, these other two, one of the other two is this, you know, so-and-so, and it's uh, in-house, and it's, it's really probably a stronger choice. And I said, thank you so much, but I, I, I made my mind, and I really love this script, which I, oh. I didn't realize at the time um, that I was doing something that was powerful, because had I made a different decision, my entire career would be so different. Was that a conversation, was it that quick, or do you call your agents and say? Oh, it was, it, there were several conversations, but I was, I was set on it, and they were, they were supportive. I mean, they questioned, but they were supportive, and, uh, and yeah, and then, I, and then I got the job, so. So, from the beginning, since you'd worked a little bit, um, did you feel like that set and that environment was, was just different from the ground up? Yes, it absolutely, was. absolutely. And I had never worked on anything um, that I had that much of a vital role in from the beginning, you know? So to be there, I remember one day I walked quietly onto the set after seeing, after, you know, one of my first days there, and I saw this giant high school that they had built inside these sound stages. And it looked and smelled just like a real high school, you know? And, and it was probably the most extensive set I had seen and then to realize that I was one of the characters at the center of the show, I started crying, I was scared. Oh, you were? I was scared. And I realized that I just felt the gravity, like I just felt the responsibility, and I had never actually felt that before. Right. But I remember being overwhelmed by the, by the size of it and, and feeling a responsibility to something like that, and, um, and nervous, hoping that I could do it.